Hello everyone, this is Don with Microsoft Corporation. In this short video, we're going to show you how to sign up for Visual Cam C, Microsoft's new plugin for Onshape. First off, you need to do two things ahead of time. Obviously, you need to have a Onshape account. If you don't have an Onshape account, you can go to Onshape.com, select the Create Account button up here, and uh, create an account. After uh, signing into your account, go into the uh, App Store button uh, up here on the top menu uh, in Onshape. Once in the App Store, on the left, just select Cam from the Categories. And if you scroll down, you will find uh, Visual Cam C for Onshape. This is an integrated cloud application uh, for Onshape and we are an Onshape partner. So select Visual Cam C and it tells you a little bit about the product here, gives you some screenshots down below and just select the uh, subscribe button. And enter your password for Onshape just for verification. And you'll see this little pop-up that shows you how to add Visual Cam C to an Onshape part. And we're going to show you that in just a moment. You can close that. So now uh, go into your Onshape account. Let's just open up a mo uh, test model and we'll show you how to add the Visual Cam C uh, application to a part. Okay, so here we have a, a, a test part in Onshape open. Now, you need to allow Visual Cam C to have access to your part model in order to run the application. So down here, we're going to add the Visual Cam C element tab to the part. So we'll select the little Add button, go to Add Application, and you'll see that Visual Cam C is now listed in your application since you subscribe to the plugin. Go ahead and pick Visual Cam C, and you'll see that a Visual Cam C tab was added to your part, and you'll see a uh, authorization dialog that displays the first time, just making sure that you're going to give uh, Visual Cam C authorization to access your part. After that, Visual Cam C, the plugin for Onshape, will load in a separate tab, item tab down here. And by default, the select part dialog uh, is displayed. So you want to select your part model from the selection dialog. And here is your part uh, in Visual Cam C. Now, another thing that's going to happen when you sign up and get added to the Visual Cam C beta program, uh, if you go back to your Onshape account and go into the menu on the left and go into Teams, you'll see that you'll have a team called Visual Cam C beta and this allows you to access parts that we have shared with you as a beta team member. Select Visual Cam C beta and one of the parts I want to show you initially we're not going to look at all these but you can look at these parts these have all been uh, programmed with toolpaths and you can look at those. Uh, this part right here is our Visual Cam C mill quick start guide part and I'm just going to show you that real quick. So here is the Onshape part for the Quick Start Guide. And down here, you see you have several tabs down here. Uh, the first tab is the Quick Start uh, Start part. So this uh, launches the Visual Cam C app and loads the part to start the tutorial, the Quick Start Guide. Now, the second tab is the completed version of the part in Visual Cam C. So this part will show you what your part will look like when you complete the Quick Start Guide. Uh, it has several uh, operations. It has a facing, uh, a profiling, uh, and a drilling operation in this Quick Start Guide. And then also the third tab uh, is the Quick Start Guide in a PDF document. So everything is contained right here in this Quick Start part. Uh, for you to get started using Visual Cam C.
if you don't want to use the document to go through the quick start guide, you can also select this uh, image here to watch a video version of the quick start guide. And this brings you to our playlist for Visual Chem C on our YouTube channel. And you can select the Visual Chem C mill quick start video right here. Now also, as I mentioned, uh, in the Visual Chem C beta team folder, in your Onshape account, you can look at some other parts here that have been programmed with Visual Cam C. Let's take a look at one. So here we see uh, a gear casing that all the tool paths have been programmed in Visual Cam C for Onshape. And we'll take a look at uh, a few of the tool paths. Here's the Z level roughing operation. And then we have a pocketing operation for the pocket areas. We have a Z-level finishing operation. We have a radial machining operation, which is another finishing operation. Then we have an engraving operation to do the chamfer around the top edge here. And we have a profiling operation to do the outside profile. And then we have another profiling operation with a fillet mill to put the fillet on the outside uh, of the part. And also, uh, if you want to get additional help, you can select the Help menu from Visual Cam C and select Help. You can also select the Feedback option uh, to send us feedback about your experience with Visual Cam C, the beta program. Well, that's it for now. We wish you the best of luck, and we're glad you could join us in the Visual Cam C beta program.